All right, thanks, April. Well, a smile, a compliment, even a quick thank you can make the difference to someone during their day. Yeah, today is Random Acts of Kindness Day. To mark the importance of remembering to be kind, we went to the one place here in Tucson that's known for doing just that. Kindness can go a long way. What we don't think about as, as individuals is we don't realize that we don't know what the other person is going through. A simple act can make someone's day a little bit brighter. It could be something as little as letting someone in at traffic. And you know, we all know that Tucson traffic can get a little crazy. Tucson is no stranger to the be kind message thanks to Ben's Bells. Executive Director Helen Gomez says the nonprofit is entering its 20th year in the old Pueblo. I think that's a testament to Tucson, the Tucson community, because they've really embraced such a simple message. It started with just a simple message to be kind. Ben's Bells has well over 200 murals in Tucson, and they have a really exciting one in the works. For people who know Tucson really well, we used to have an iconic I Am Tucson mural that was here in downtown Tucson. Unfortunately, with all the renovations, the mural didn't survive. We are going to recreate it on the uh, front of the Tucson Convention Center. Gomez tells us this should be happening in the fall. You'll have a chance to take part in the mural's creation. Leading up to that, we're going to have a lot of community workshops where people can come and make a tile and, and have a little tile that's a piece of the mural. And there's still plenty to take part in if you just want to stop by one of their locations. You could be glazing, you could be um, assembling bells, you could be making uh, one of the things that people really like to do that we we don't always get to do it, but uh, tiles for murals. But don't forget, she kindness can start with you. It starts with one person. So it's one person and maybe it's a student and then they take it home and then it's their, their parents and then we have the teachers involved. Before you know it, we are all taking part in building kinder communities. Yeah, so the executive director tells us they have kind notes and a kindness calendar that you can download off the Ben's Bells website. That calendar has pretty simple acts like start a gratitude journal or something as simple as remembering to ask for help when you need it. We have a link to their website on kega9.com uh, so you can see everything that Ben's Bells offers.